good afternoon. How's everybody doing tonight? Happy Friday. Welcome to my channel. My name is Tanya. I don't normally come on on Friday nights, but I just thought I'd get on here. I know that a lot of us are, um, I know that there's some, you know, thunderstorms and things, um, that a lot of us are, are, um, under under storm watches and things so i just wanted to get on here and say a say a little prayer for those of us who um might be experiencing some bad bad weather and uh and then i just thought i'd chat a few minutes uh just um see what i feel led to share amen <laughs> hope everybody's doing good Let's pray. Father God, I just I just thank you so much. Father, you are so good. You are such a good and merciful Father. Lord, I thank you and I praise you and I love you today. Lord, I just ask that you put your words in my mouth for your people, Lord. I just, um, just want to chat with them, Lord, and I just pray that you just lead me in that, Lord. I pray that... Um, Anybody who is under any kind of severe thunderstorm watches tonight, Lord, I pray as as I am, Lord, I pray, Lord, that you would just calm the storms, Lord, just calm the storms, Amen. In Jesus' name, Lord, I just pray against any any tornadoes, any um, hail damage, just any any severe storms, Lord. I just. Uh, I just pray, Lord, that you would calm the storms for me as well as any anybody else, Lord, that's um, might be facing storms tonight, Lord. Calm the storms, and not just natural storms, Lord. If anybody is facing any any um, any storms in their life, Lord, I pray that you would calm those storms as well, Lord. I know that you will, Father, G uh, Lord Jesus. I know that you're in the boat, Amen. And we. Uh, we just um, we just look to you, Lord Jesus, as I know that you're in our boat, Lord, calming our storms as always, and I thank you for it, Lord Jesus. Anyways, Father, I plead the blood of Jesus over myself right now. I plead the blood of Jesus over this video. I plead the blood of Jesus over those watching this video, and I just um, I just. Uh, I just ask you again, Lord, to put your words in my mouth for your people today. Greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. No weapons formed against us shall prosper. Every tongue that rises up against us in judgment, Lord, you will show to be wrong. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord. Amen. Father, I give you all praise, all glory, all honor. In Jesus' name, Lord, bless your people. In Jesus' name, touch the, touch the sick tonight as well, Lord. I know many are hurting and sick, Lord, and I just ask that your healing virtue would be applied to the sick tonight, Lord, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Anyways, um, I, uh, I like to do, you know, just as a hobby, I, I like to thrift. And I found a couple of really interesting books um, today. And, of course, y'all know that I, I love the Bible and I love to read the Bible Um and I often do that on here, but I also found a couple of books that I'll be reading, and maybe I'll even share some of them, some of it with y'all in the days to come, but one of them has always been uh, um, real fascinating to me, um, you know, uh, like when athletes, I remember the Tim Tebow, when he used his platform, uh, you know, to witness, I, I think that I heard that John, when he had put um, John three sixteen under his eyes, I think he was in his college, maybe in his college football days. I'm not sure, um, but I remember reading somewhere that um, how John three sixteen had been Googled millions and millions of times. So that was awesome. But anyway, I've, I found a book today, and it's called Playing with Purpose by Mike Yorkie, and it has um, inside the lives and faith of 27 great football 
basketball and baseball stars. Tim Tebow, of course, is, is one of them. And then it's got some others. Kevin Durant, Mariano Rivera. Anyway, 27 of them. So I'm looking forward to reading that. That's always, I've always loved whenever we see celebrities and athletes using their platforms to, you know, to witness for our Savior. It's just so awesome. And it takes a lot of courage, you know, in such, such worldly environments, you know, in, in any workplace really, but on such a, such a large, um, large scale. It's just awesome when they do that. And I just praise God for it. So anyways, I'm excited about this book guys. And, um, and then I have another one and it's called Hearts of Fire. And, um, it's eight women in the underground church and their stories of costly faith. So I know that's going to be awesome as well. I look forward to reading that. Um, uh, the voice of the martyrs. Anyways, of course, we know that persecution, um, you know, we might face persecution in America, but probably not, not like in other countries, amen, where they are actually having to, to walk out their faith underground, amen. So anyways, two books I'm really looking forward to reading and maybe, maybe sharing some insight with y'all in the days to come. Anyways, um... I remember when I was, you know how when you're a kid, um, there, there's like that one, that one, um, preteen idol, um, mine was Kirk Cameron. I loved Kirk Cameron. Um, and of course I, I don't even think back when I watched him on Growing Pains, I, I don't even, I don't even think he was a Christian yet. And we know how awesome, um, um, he spreads the gospel now and makes Christian movies and all that. But, you know, back when he was on Growing Pains, I just thought he was awesome. And uh, and now I just, uh, I, of course, you know, have watched his career over the years and the Christian movies that he makes and just how he uses his, um, you know, his platform to to witness and, and everything. It's just awesome. God is, God is so, so good. Amen. Um, anyways, I know I'm just rambling. <laughs> I just, uh, I just, my girls are with their dad this weekend. And so, um, I'm just, uh, just thought I'd get on and chat with y'all. Um, hope everybody's doing okay. Uh, I've got to, I work on the weekends pretty long hours. So, I don't get on here very much on the weekends. I almost almost don't get on here at all. But anyways, uh, I hope uh, everybody has a wonderful weekend. And just um, just know that I'll be praying for everybody in in the past of these storms. I know that God's under con God's God and under control. Amen. He's got us, and we'll just be praying and believing that God will calm the storms for us all. Amen. God is able. Amen. Anyways, I love y'all, and I hope y'all have a wonderful night and a great weekend, and until my next video, Jesus loves you, and bye!